Okay, there we go. I was a bit late in realizing I had to do some video. So welcome YouTube. We're at the EMCR in Rosenberg again. And I am going to maiden this little beauty. It's a 74 inch laser extreme flight with a DA35. Savok servos should be fun. The idle is good. Pickup is awesome. Uh, all the way around. Come on, honey bunny. Bit of up trim, a bit of right ail run. But hey, she's flying! <laughs> I had one like this before and the knife edge is just crazy stable it's bizarre needs almost no input now I am flying it high so I will add some footage of later flights to this video but the engine is new as well so I don't want to risk stuff I'm just taking it easy right now I will be doing all kinds of crazy with it later on, I think, but... Knife edge spin, nice. Into flat spin, cool. Have to get used to the required input, but oh, it looks awesome. Looks like we're gonna have a whole bunch of fun together. Ah, nice. As I said, knife edge is awesome, so slow rolls are really easy to do as well. <laughs> awesome, popped up. Cool. I'm doing it all a bit higher now, but it looks really stable in Harrier as well. Just a bit of wing rock, but that's okay. And I hate Harriers that high up because you can't see what you're doing.
mais. And I have to work on the expo as well because I think I have just a bit too much. Oh, very nice. Cool. It does the, what's it called again as well? Cool stuff. Nice, loving it. And I had the option to do this in electric, but I actually really wanted a plane on gas of which I didn't have to remove the um, the horizontal stabilizers to transport it in the car. I sold the I sold my pilot yak, the 88 inch one because you know, whenever I went to the field and had enough time, you know, to do a long build up with uh, the horizontal steps as well. I just, I wouldn't take the Yak anymore, but I would take a bigger one, you know, I would take the 104 inch. So I really wanted to have a gas plane that was easy to take to the field and this is it, this is it and it's awesome. Have to admit, I had a, I, I was doubting myself a little bit, was second guessing a little bit because obviously the, uh, the slick 580. Uh, is available in um, in 74 inch as well, but I just love I love my previous laser. It uh, sadly met his maker in a in a little crash, but now I know again why I wanted it back. You know, it's. Time for landing, something fell off, it's a wheel pant, that's okay. I've got an extra one, <laughs> shit, <laughs> I have to look for that. I think I can actually find that again. Hello Munchkin. Nice. Thank you, precious. Oh, awesome. Don't you just love that after maiden feeling where you think you can take on the world? Awesome. Whew. That was cool. Thanks a lot for watching. I'm going to enjoy my walk to look for that wheel pen that fell off. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Fire the laser! Damage report! Damage report! It's okay. It's all right. Come on. Well, actually, that was just footage from the movie Independence Day, but the real laser would be a lot like that. Yeah. <laughs>